Hi everyone, it's Nick here. Now up to now, I don't think I have reviewed a wrestling game, so here's a wrestling game. It's WWE Road to WrestleMania Times 8 on the Game Boy Advance, uh, published by THQ in 2002. Now in this handheld game, you can control any one of 15 playable characters, each have their own different abilities which change according to your fighting style. Um, there's quite a lot of depth in this one, there's 7 game modes and 8 match types, a championship, gauntlet, king of the ring, royal rumble which is always my favourite to watch on TV, and the 8 match type range from cages to lumberjack matches. Hooray, we'll put this on easy mode. So I'm quite looking forward to playing this one. So there we go, Championship, King of the Ring, Royal Rumble, Gauntlet and Pay-Per-View. In Pay-Per-View you um, select the sort of matches you want to fight, uh, customization, and then you get the amount of views. So we can call either The Rock, Triple H, 15 characters here, Hollywood Hogan, used to be called Hulk Hogan, bit old now, The Undertaker, Kurt Angle, Chris Jericho, all your faves, Kane, Kevin Nash, Rob Van Dam, Edge, not the one out of U2, Booker T, Bubba Ray Dudley, Devon Dudley, let's say, don't know him, Christian, need to fancy a name, Test, what Test? The Rock, Roll, who can we choose, it's going to be the R Hulk Hogan, now in Royal Rumble, if you are unfamiliar with wrestling, you start off in the ring, uh, either first or pre-designed time and um, a different wrestler goes to the ring every five or so minutes and you must be the last one standing. This is our entrance music, Hulk Hogan looking a bit pedestrian there but he is 165 years old now. I love the rock people are saying, at least I hope that's what he's saying. Can't see the R. Here we go, who's next? It's Booker T is it? I don't know, it isn't Booker T. Who is it? Don't know. I didn't remember the lineup. We'll soon find out what it says at the top there. Mr. Hogan versus. Oh, it's D. Von Dam. Come on, Hulk! Right, let's get used to these buttons here. Oh, uh, right. Now, the A button on the Game Boy Advance is to grapple, B is the attack button. So it's not too sophisticated. When you get close, just hit B for all your worth. And the R is to start running, and I'm I'm finding it a bit hard to get to grips with this. Hulk Hogan face the right way. There we go. Yay! Take that, Von Dam. Oops. There we go. Bounce off the ring. Good. Now, you, the idea is is to throw people out the ring here somehow. When I've done that, then the next one comes. Oops! I've been chucked out the ring. Oh, that was very brief. Hulk. Hollywood Hogan. Go back to school, man. Well, that ended quite quickly. Let's do one of the other versions here. Yeah, it moves a bit slow, this, but um, that's like wrestling games in general, really. Got to get used to controls. Got to get in the right position and hit the B button, which is attack at the right time. You can do power drivers, uh, other moves. In sense my knowledge of wrestling isn't great. Clothesline, that's one of them. Right, let's go into an exhibition match. Single mode. Look at look the customization on this, it's great in terms of customization. The gameplay isn't super brilliant, it's like okay. I wouldn't be disappointed if I bought this game, but it could be a bit better. This is the first wrestling game I've played, so I haven't got too much of a comparison, but I will be playing other ones. There is a WWF a Road to WrestleMania as well on the Game Boy Advance. Don't know if that came out before this one or not, but I'm controlling The Rock this time versus Triple H. The crowd have gone crazy, at least on one side. On my side there, they're all a bit static. Go, go, go. We're both in black, makes it a bit difficult. Rock versus Triple H. What do the H's stand for? Hideous, uh, helpful, um, uh, hilarious. Get out of that, Rock. Right, hopefully I'm going to get used to the controls a bit better here. Oops. Yeah, Triple H is getting me, right? Punch, yeah, take that. How'd you like them apples? You don't, do you? I'm good at not facing the right way in this game. Whoops, no, you're not going to do that to me. There's some blue power bars there. I think when it's uh, up its top of its strength, you can do a pin move. But if you can pin your opponent uh, for three seconds, then you win. 
or if he dies, you win. I don't think you can kill people in this. But if your opponent, once you've got them under pin, puts their leg on the ropes, that uh, breaks it and you must release. I want to do some power elbow moves where I drop from a height onto their head. Right, I've got the running good. Time it. Yay, look at that. Close line. Let's have another one. Oh, missed him that time. That would have looked good on the telly. Let's get ready to rumble. Oh dear, that's not good. good luck I didn't break my nose then. Come on. Who's the champion of WWE at the moment? Is it The Rock or Triple H? Or is it neither of those two? I think The Rock's gone into films now, hasn't he? Hulk Hogan tried to go into films. Mr. Nanny. Oh, no, I think it all went wrong. Some other stuff happened also. Let's not go there. Right, I'm trying to do a variety of moves here, but it's just close combat. Hit the B button when you can. Oh, oh. I'm out the ring. Right, what happens now? I must have fallen about five feet there. I'm still okay. Take that, Triple H. We've got ten seconds to get back into the ring, whatever button we press, or we're both out. Oops. Kicked in the bottom. Look, we should be friends. We've got the same trunks on. Right, let's get back in here. Well, there we go. I'm in. Hopefully Triple H doesn't go back in. He's in. What are some of these signs people are holding up? I love HHH. Yeah. Oops. Oh, Right, grab him by the hair. We're both on the tops of our power meters, which means that we must be able to do special moves. In this, you can do tag matches also. There's lots of stuff you can do in this. You name the sort of match you can do, this game provides it. Whoops, I was trying to bounce off the ropes then for a close, here we go. Yeah. Eat canvas. Da -da 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 -da. I like this music as well. It's a little bit repetitive after a while, but it's a uh, normal fare. Why is my bar gone zero? Does this mean I can do him? How do I pin pin it? I think I do the, the uh, R and left button at the same time, but if he's near the rope, he's just going to break it straight away. How is this man still alive? Let's pin him. No, he's broken him with the rope. Where's the referee? In wrestling, there's a ref, isn't there, going around the ring? There isn't a ref in this. The console version of this game sure must have had a referee. It must be the constraints. Oh, that's good. The constraints of the uh, handheld here. Right, pin, pin, pin. Trying to do the pin buttons here. Left and R at the same time. Give up, Triple H. I mean, for a small screen thing, uh, you can see the breathing of your opponents. They've done quite well as a, as a 3D engine. Got a bit of depth to it, definitely. Bit of give in the ropes. Right, I'm going to have to pin him soon. This is going on a bit too long. Stop the fight. Look, he's breathing in and out. He doesn't know where he is. Go on the floor so I can pin you. God. Pin. All right, here we go. One. One. Two. Oh, he kicked out of it. I thought he was dead to the world. How did he get out of that one? Oh, he switched the play. I'm against the ropes. Boof. Oh, God, that was a good move. Don't say he's going to come back from the dead here. Get out of that. Triple H. My favourite wrestler, probably of all time, was Randy Macho Man Savage. He used to dress quite sedately. Very casual dresser. If you don't know who Randy Macho Man Savage is, do a Google search and you see how conservative dressed he is. Right, we got him this time. Yeah! In your face, Triple H. Triple loser, more like. Is cooking. Oh, how the rock. Yeah. Good stuff. Right, the winner. Rock. We won't do a rematch. Um, I think we'll do one other type of game to just show you how it plays. But basically, the, the fighting's the same all the time. So it, it's pretty uh, irrelevant what mode you do. The fighting's always roughly the same. Who can we be this time? Kurt Angle? No, let's be The Undertaker. Look at that, I like the different modes, it gives you good graphics. This is like a championship here. Hogan vs Jericho first of all, we've got an option to watch it or skip it. I'll skip it. And we're fighting Booker T. I think Booker T's good at like different kicks and stuff. There's his fans. What's this music? This is The Undertaker coming in. What would be your walking music if you was a wrestler? Comment below and tell me why that would be your walking music. Or entrance music. Hopefully it's not Barbie Girl. 
What's this? What music is this? Booker T is coming in. And he's white trunks and white boots. Everyone walks roughly the same in this. All hail Booker T. Book him, Dano. Right, can he be... I thought The Undertaker was taller than this. Everyone seems to be the same height in this game. That's uh, that's one drawback. Oh, we're going to exchange punches. Yep, yeah, boof. Telling him who's boss straight away. Oh, I almost stamped on him there. I missed him slightly. Right. Oh, look at that. We don't want him doing his kicking moves. So, so, as soon as he starts doing that, we're in trouble. Oops, he's reversed it. He's just waiting for me to get up. No one stops the undertow. Oh, look at... Oh, no. He's doing his Bruce Lee stuff already. The crowd are going mental. It's the best fight they've seen in this review. Not sure all time, really. Some people are stationary, others are just holding signs up and down. Check out those stationary people. They might be waxworks to boost the viewing figures. Check out them for a pulse. Right. I think Booker D, is he breathing heavily? Ooh, that's called a power driver, I think. Right, I've got him now. One, two. What? How did he break out of that? Any normal person would be unconscious. He must be Superman. So a lot of it is grappling and timing when to do holds, really. There's not a great deal of moves here, but even so, I'm still finding it quite enjoyable. Whether I find it still enjoyable or my temp go of it, I'm not so sure. But it does represent wrestling quite well. The animation's quite good. A definite sense of depth to it with the 3D animation. I'd say uh, this is okay, this game. It's, it's like in the middle of good. Oh dear, and that one good. Right, a kick to the chops. 2002, this one. You can play, if you've got four Game Boys, you can play up to four players, and I think it would get better with actual live players and a bit more funny. Because against the computer AI opponents, the play is quite predictable after a while. With four of you always different characters, it could get quite funny. Especially if it's two of you against another two. And uh, sort of like tag team, that'd be quite awesome. Well, I don't know three other people that Game Boy and Boy. Oh, yeah. that's a different system. I don't know three people that have got Game Boy advances. One, I think I might two, let him win. Three. Yeah, well, okay, well done, Booker T, but I'll let you win. Da -da 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 -da. Only because I let you win, you big show off. What's happened to his face? He's lost all his facial features apart from his beard. Well, game over, King of the Ring. Well, anyway, I hope you liked having a look at that game. That was WWE Road to WrestleMania x 8 or X8, published by THQ in 2002. Um, please remember to rate, comment and subscribe if you haven't already. That's always very helpful. Until next time, take care of yourself and goodbye. Goodbye.